Hey guys, so my chair has finally arrived. I am so happy. I'm gonna actually start to assemble it together myself, which is something I've never done. I've never assembled anything myself. Uh, my room is such a tip at the minute because I've got boxes, luggage, clothes everywhere. I haven't unpacked properly from Turkey, but I'm just so excited. I just wanna get this over and done with, and then I'm just gonna go for like a proper clean through this room and pack everything away. Put my suitcase upstairs, even though I am going away in like a week and a half, but I just wanna get my suitcase out of the way and get everything done, but I'm so excited. Excited. It's not that hard to put together because the sofa itself, well the armchair itself, has got numbers on it. There's also got numbers on the bottom of each of the stool bits. What are these? It's got just the right amount of screws and also you just use one of these to tighten them up. Do what you do, you know that all I think about is you. One leg down. This is possibly the first thing I've ever built, apart from like in DT class, which I absolutely loved. I love design technology. I was really good at it and I really, really enjoyed it. I had so much fun. Things you say, I don't know how you make me feel this way. I got you inside my And we're on to the last leg. Not bad. I think this has taken me about 15 minutes. Now I'm just gonna stick these on the bottom just so that the floor is like scratch proof. Just protects the bottom of the shoes and the bottom of your floor, the bottom of your shoes. <laughs> just protects the bottom of your legs of your chair. Oh my god. Oh, I love it. I absolutely love it. This is exactly what I wanted. I'm in love. Oh my god. I'm so happy. So now I'm just going to clean up this whole area and kind of just make it ready for filming and everything. Oh, I'm so excited. Hi guys. I want to talk about my new Turkish delights. <laughs> Um, they are so nice. They come with a box <laughs> and it's got packaging on it. <laughs> but it's so clever, you can see through the packaging to the packaging itself. <laughs> These are Turkish delights with nuts in them. Um, what kind of nuts? They are Antipistic de Locum. They taste really nice, but it's not good if you've got allergy to nuts. Okay, they taste really, really nice. And I'm not going to share any with my sister. Thanks, guys. Bye. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually including it in my video. Okay, thank you. <laughs> Let me see what it looks like to play back. Good morning, guys. It's Tuesday now. I'm off to a meeting with LMS in Covent Garden. I feel really ill, but it's actually my hay fever because I forgot to take my tablets, which is perfect. I'm on my way to my meeting, I just bought some extra tablets and a tissue because my nose was like running everywhere, which is gross. But yeah, I'm off to my meeting, which I'm excited about because I love LMS. And we're going to Bathsa, which is really, really nice. I want you to stay with me when you're with me. went amazing I had to quickly rush into Selfridges to pick up something I wanted to record a video on my summer makeup look and I wanted to try out the new well it's not new it's new for me it's the your skin but better it's cosmetic CC plus uh, full coverage cream foundation type of thing it's more like a tinted moisturizer I'd say but my skin looks absolutely better and to be honest I feel like as it is on longer it looks better and better I am so impressed with this honestly video goes up on Wednesday which will be a few days ago for you guys so I will link it down below if anyone's interested to see how it goes on and what color I went for and everything I'm so happy with this and I cannot wait to be using this more and more I feel like this is probably gonna be my new 
must have item. My friend Charlotte, who was also on the trip to Turkey, was using it every day and her skin looked flawless. And it didn't look like she was wearing any makeup whatsoever. So I'm really, really excited about this, honestly. Like, my skin just feels so free, but it looks like flawless. I am feeling myself. So the rest of the day, I'm gonna spend editing this video that I just filmed. And if I have any time, start editing my vlog for Turkey because I need that to go up for Sunday. Honestly, there's so much footage because it was such a long trip. I don't know what I'm gonna do, but I'm also off to go and see Aiten and Abadeh and the baby tonight because I miss them so much and I've been so busy I haven't been able to see them for a very, very long time. So I wanna see them before I go away again next week, so. And I'm hungry right now, I'm so hungry. I need to find something to eat. It's about two o'clock, I haven't had any lunch, so I need to eat something. Hey guys, so now it's Thursday and I'm on my way to the very press event. I can't wait to go and see all of their new pieces. We'll go and see what they've got for the next season. had the time to come and explain to you guys what I received at my meeting with Elemis. I have quite a few beauty brands that I keep coming back to and mix and match and stuff and Elemis is one of my favourite ones. So I've got some refills of the Pro Collagen Hydro Gel Eye Mask. Absolutely love these. Love taking these on the plane with me because it's just so easy to use and I just feel like my eyes really need that little bit more of hydrogen and keeps them really really nice and puffs them and everything next i got the superfood facial oil i don't think i have this one already i do have the advanced nighttime one but i haven't got the advanced skincare superfood facial oil recently started using the superfood facial wash which i'm loving at the minute the smell of it is incredible really really good so i can't wait to try this one out as well herbal lavender repair mask Ooh, for congestive sensitive skin, purifies, smooths and rebalances. Oh, I'm excited to try this twice a week. Oh, I'm excited to try that. I love lavender. This is perfect for nighttime routines. Next, we've got a dynamic resurfacing gel mask. Never tried this one either. I've never actually tried a gel mask before. So I'm excited to see that. Next is my favorite product from the range, the anti-aging pro collagen cleansing balm. I absolutely love using a balm to take off my makeup. It just melts everything away. Absolutely wonderful. Love this product. And it comes with its own flannel as well. And a girl can never have too many flannels. And I always take my makeup off using a flannel. So there we go. Something new that I'm excited to try is a dynamic resurfacing facial pad. So it's like a toner, but it's in a pad form. And I've never tried this before, so I'm excited to try it. Is a pro collagen overnight matrix. It's a night cream. Love it. I love a good night cream. I'm in need of using a new night cream anyway. So this has come at the perfect timing. And something that a lot of people, myself included, did not know. So Elemis also have a skin range. So we have got a sea lavender and samphire bath and shower milk and also a sea lavender and samphire body cream. So I'm excited to take these away with me to Cyprus and try them out while I'm out there. And then also every year LMS collaborate with a brand and this year they've collaborated with Lily and Lionel to create this exclusive travel bag. And inside they've got a few of the hero products in there such a pretty bag i love it i also received this beautiful watch from guess absolutely obsessed with it it's got three different dials i'm not gonna lie but i don't really have a clue about them okay so this one i'm guessing is the day this one is I don't know. I haven't got a clue. Anywho, I just really like the look of this watch. I thought it was really pretty. It's from Guess. So thank you, Guess, for sending this over to me. I just think it's going to look so nice on. And the last thing I want to show you guys is from the very press event. They very kindly gifted us all a Beats headphone. And the funny thing is, I was actually looking at 
purchasing a Beats headphone recently. My friend Georgia was using them while we were away in Turkey and I just really like them. So what perfect timing, right? So thank you guys so, so, so much. That's very, very kind of you guys. I was supposed to go to a few events today. I had the next press day and I also had an event with Ole, but I have got so much work to do. I have four hours worth of footage that I need to edit down into my turkey vlog. Four hours is absolutely ridiculous. I don't think I've ever had that much footage that I have to go through. So this is possibly going to be a two-part vlog. I might do like Bodrum Marmaris and then Oludenis on its own. I don't know. I'm just going to edit as much as I can. But I don't want them to be too long. But yeah, I've just got so much to do now that I can't. I actually couldn't force myself out of the house to go to these events. I mean, the events are amazing and stuff. But this work is so much more important and this needs to be done. So I have to just sit at home today and edit my little bum away. But I'm really happy because I've now got a desk. It arrived this morning. Um, it's just like a little fold away desk where I can sit my laptop here. And also when I'm filming, I can have all my makeup and my mirror here as well. So super, super handy. My chair's arrived as well. So I'm like just really happy and feeling super motivated. And I've been waking up really early this week. It's possibly the jet lag from Turkey, but I mean, I'm not complaining. Yeah, so I've edited down one hour already. Three more hours worth to get through. <laughs> hey guys, how are we doing today? I hope you're all doing well. Today is now Monday. I had such a relaxing week. The weather was beautiful, so we just had like a really nice family barbecue and we have like these oven things that like heaters these oven heaters I guess and we had those on during the night because it started to get a little bit cold and blankets and it was just really really nice I really enjoyed myself today I spent the morning just answering emails and I did a little bit of editing but definitely not enough I just didn't feel that great this morning couldn't wake up properly I just felt super tired and then I just felt really nauseous the whole day so I was being a bit lazy I'm not gonna lie oh also what else I did today I was preparing for my trip on Thursday to Cyprus so I ordered some clothes and talking to brands about stuff now I've just uploaded my picture for Instagram today and I'm gonna head off to go and see my boyfriend and that's pretty much today over with tomorrow Tomorrow I will be editing and I will just see you guys tomorrow. Today has been a bit of a bad day. For you, you know it's what you say and what you do. I got you.